Hi Libra, this is Kelly. For those of you who are new to me, my name is Kelly Lunt and I'm an intuitive channel with the team of seven spirit guides at the current moment. Um, we most like to, ooh, two cards popped up, but we most like to come through and help people who are feeling stuck, insecure, indecisive. You know there's something that you want and you don't know how to get there. We love channeling for those people. Um, so that's for my guides, that's who I am, that's what I do, and I come on here every month just to make um, just cards, pull some cards, half tarot, more half channeled, letting you know what it is you need to know for the month ahead, July, to manifest whatever it is you want with ease, joy, and bliss. So I heavily apply the law of attraction as well. Um, and as I'm shuffling this last deck here, I want to let you know that I made a PDF. It's completely free. It's how to develop and trust your own intuition and your own intuitive this is for the ultimate beginner ultimate beginner and if you're trying to develop your clairsentient clairvoyant and clairaudescence this will help with that so you want to sign up in the upper right hand corner there's a link you'll click on it you'll go to it you'll enter your name and your email address and you'll get emailed the pdf as well as a guided meditation to meet your personal spirit guide um so it takes you on a journey to the temple of the masters where a lot of people have already been emailing me saying that they met their spirit guide, they received energy from the spirit guide, they're able to make it to the temple. Um, it's tons of fun. Um, so I made that, it's free. Just click in the upper right hand corner to get the link to download that. You'll, you'll get an email, you'll have to click confirm that you did want to receive that, and then you'll get emailed the PDF and the meditation. Um, okay, so let's see there, Libra, what's going on for you this month? Okay, there's definitely a need for you to be a team player yeah guys you definitely got um this kind of can you see the cards you got the three of earth card the daniel the marriage card and the friendship card so the base of this month libra like the basis for you having success this month is the need to be a team player all around it's um yeah I, there's no other really way to say that spirit is there anything else i need to know about that it's about being a team player and allowing others into the process, allowing others into the decision-making process, allowing others into your emotional process, to your emotional processing process. Allow others in to, to perhaps influence you a little bit this month. You know, because your loved ones close to you, like they have to have a little bit of influence on you. It's letting them in so that they feel like they're part of a team. So this is coworkers, bosses, uh, it can be a romantic partner. It can be with friends. It's allowing your friends in on part of your journey so that they feel like they're part of the team. A little bit more of a unified front. Um, and Because underneath that, like a little more clarification. Um, yeah, it's that. So you did an ask to the universe. Your step one ask of what you wanted was you wanted more love in your life. You wanted more support. So now that you've asked for that, you got to allow the universe to deliver. And how the universe is delivering that right now is by others trying to give you support. And you're just, you're just not used, you're just kind of used to being the lone wolf and doing everything on your own, doing just things your way, your way or that highway. Uh, it might be a little harsh how that's worded, but you're definitely used to doing it alone. But you've asked for close relationships. The Queen of Water, you've asked for more love. You've asked for more loving, supportive relationships. You've just asked for more care and concern in your life, more support, more well-being, more relationships. And they're delivering that via other people right now. So let them in to help. Let them in to help. Um, okay, is there anything about this card, Spirit? It's just about letting them in to help. Like before you try to, oh, that's what it is. That's a late card. Before you try to take uh, your relationships next, like just to say you're at the at that place of wanting to propose to your girlfriend, wait until you practice the letting them in to feel more like a team player. Because obviously, if you're gonna get married to someone, you want to, they want to, they want to feel like they're part of your team, right? Um, or like before you make a decision to work with a an employer, um, wait until like maybe do, can you do like a trial day of working there? Or before you decide to work with a new coach, wait and observe some more of their um, online Facebook Live type of a thing. Um, 
just you need a more of an approach of allowing others in so that they feel like they're part of your team. And so your challenge for allowing that to happen, again, guys, it's more you taking the time, Libra. It's more you. It's more you. It's it's you taking the time and it's you. You're, you're kind of just used to doing it all, Libra. You're used to doing it your way, your way or the highway. You're really just used to doing it your way. You've got to allow a little bit more of a spiritual approach because like, yes, the timing is right to open up and allow other people into your life, to allow them to help you, to allow them to give you a shout out on a YouTube video to grow your channel, to allow them to run an ad for you. The time is definitely right for them to help you. It's just, can you accept the help? Can you ask for the help? It's definitely like the only thing blocking you from receiving this month is you and you being willing to receive the help, you being willing to ask for the help, you being willing to just like acknowledge that you even need help. There's nothing wrong with acknowledging that you need help. Like get your, get your mental sanity, they're saying. In terms of what you've learned in the past, Yeah, you've definitely been feeling confused about, it's kind of like you're confused why you haven't been getting the same kind of success that you've been, you're confused why you haven't been getting the same kind of success and you've been plowing through and plowing through and plowing through and keep doing it. Um, it's getting to the point where like, you're, I don't want to say burnout, I don't want to say exhaustion, but it's kind of like you're tired of spinning the same wheels. That's, that's what you learned in the past. And do you see how that relates to what's going on? That you need to rely on help from others. You need to let them into the decision-making process. So in terms of what you're learning right now, so four cards popped out. So give me a second to, whenever it's four cards, it's just a little bit, takes a little more time. In terms of what you're learning right now, Okay, you got the Dreamer, which is the Fool card. You got the Eight of Water. You got the Mystique, which is kind of like the Chariot card. So you definitely want something else. You definitely want a bigger life. You definitely want more than what it is you have right now. It's just be aware that the Fool card, it, it's the very... It's like the kid who's just leaving to college who's lead a very sheltered life of, oh boy, off to college, and he doesn't understand how the big world works. So just, you want more. You want something bigger than what it is that you've had before, and you want to do the approach of just plowing through, plowing through, work, 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 doing what you've, do, getting success how you've gotten it before. Um, however, there's a part of you that wants a more fulfilling life. You want a more... I don't want to use the word balance, but you're definitely looking for more fulfillment. You're looking, so it's like you want more, you want something, but you either want more money, a more successful business, um, higher paying job, closer relationship, more supportive relationship. Like you cut, you want it all Libra. You want it all. Um, but what's gotten you to this point today has been plow, 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 work, 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 work. That's not going to get you what it is that you actually want because what you want is you want more fulfillment and you want more satisfaction. You want all areas of your life going well. So you see, do you see how like sometimes in business, how I just plow, 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 work hard, work hard, work hard, that can get you some success. But what you want is more fulfillment. You want it all. You want the, you want the love life. You want the time with the kids. You want the amazing career. You can't plow through with your kids like that. Hey, okay, let's sit down. Let's have tea. Tell me about your day. Da, 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 da. Okay, good. Do this for your homework. Like, dude, that's not fun. What kid wants to talk to that kind of a mom or a dad? What husband wants to like bond with that kind of a wife? What wife wants to bond with that kind of a husband who's just, okay, we're spending our 15 minutes a day. We're bonding. Dun, dun, dun. Bye. Like, you got to have a different approach for what it is that you want, Libra. So in terms of what you're learning in the future... Okay, yeah, this month is definitely, because they're definitely saying you've been doing a lot of work in the past. You've been doing a lot of a lot of work of uh, plowing through, getting, they're kind of saying career success to get like the career success that you want. You've been doing a lot of that work. So just as you go forward throughout this month, the desire for a successful family life, a successful rounded life where you kind of have it all done. They're definitely saying more of a spiritual connection, more of like a happy home family life. Um, 
you're going to heavily desire that. And it's almost you're, you're going to hit your point where you're like, okay, fine, let's try it a new way. Like I admit how I've been doing it. It hasn't like, you're going to hit that point of like, all right, I, I think I got it to get what I actually want. I think I got to try it a new way. Um, in terms of your power for this month, your power for the month is knowing that when you consult an expert, that's still you very much in power. That's still very much you in control. That's you admitting, hey, this part of my life isn't going as well as I would like, and I would like it to go better. And it's knowing, it's kind of just knowing that that, that the desire and the outcome can came. And the wheel, the wheel's like a major, major iconic card, guys. So this is kind of a big month for you guys, Libra. Um, it's knowing that this change, being willing to invite an expert from the outside in to help you, it will bring about positive change. And it's not admitting failure. It's not admitting fault. It's you reached out for the help. Um, sorry, guys. <laughs> you reached out for the help. So it's kind of like take credit in that type of a thing. So your power is reaching out for the help that you do need. Know that that help will likely lead you to the results. Obviously, if you hire a crappy coach, you're going to get crappy results. So the power is within you to hire the right person who you know could help you and knowing that it will bring about the positive change that you do want. Allowing help in will help you get the results that you want. Um, guys, if you need help changing your mindset around outsourcing work, around allowing help in, around especially around deeper relationships and close relationships with friends, family, loved ones, that's like my jam. I could help you with that. My guides will come through and will clear out any old inner childhood that's preventing, that's blocking you from like having the close intimacy that you want. Any blocks, any chakra alignment work that needs to get done will come through. We'll clean that out. And, you know, then we'll invoke like law of attraction we'll, and we'll give you energetic steps to take to, you know, align the energy, get the vibes right. But then we'll also give you like practical human level exercises, psychology tips and tricks and exercises that you can do to manifest what it is that you want. Um, Okay, so in terms of, let's see, this is the, this is how others might influence you and like either challenge, help you out. This is how others are going to affect the month. Okay. Others around you, this is the four of fires, the ultimate family, ultimate contentment, ultimate like, la la la, we're having fun card, good times flowing in the love life. Um, others around you want that. Others around, sorry guys, the lighting's a little funny. Others around you want that. Your friends, if you're single, your friends are like, Kelly, quit working so hard. Come hang out with us. If you're married, hey, babe, just take the night off. If you only make 9000 this month instead of 10000 I don't care. I know that if we hang out more, our life will be more synchronistic and synergy and flowing well. Um, others want you to have it all. And they're trying to help. Guys, they're trying to help. If you're having trouble allowing help in, got book a session, guys. I could help with that easily. Um, okay, in terms of your hopes or fears for the month. Okay, Spirit, I need help clarifying this. In terms of their hopes or fears for the month, for the Libras. Okay, you're definitely hitting a point where you realize like, it's got to change. It's got to be different. I didn't work this hard to get this level of success in my career to not have an amazing love life. I, you're definitely hitting a point where you're like, okay, the way I've been doing things, I know it has to change, but I don't know how. So they're almost saying like, it's like you're afraid of a couple things. Like you're afraid of exploring your options because it's kind of like you're afraid of just getting stuck in analysis paralysis of thinking instead of doing. But what they're saying is like, no, because it this because you got some major arcana cards in here, dude. Like allowing someone in, allowing them to be a team player. Like that's a big change. That's a huge change. And remember, you you were plow 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 throughout work 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 to get the su success that you got. You have to take a different approach now. So be willing to explore your options. Be willing to observe other couples how they get it done. Be willing to observe other coaches how they get it done. Be willing to observe um, other coworkers how they're getting their work done. Because it's definitely like know that where's that card. Know that if you are willing to take the time to explore your options, you're not delaying the outcome. This is part of the process. This is part of the process of taking care of yourself. It's part of the process of knowing your mental mind and your emotional mind, your spiritual side. Um, like your challenge is like, is stop doing the push, 
push, push, push, push, and allowing others in to help you. You know you've got to do it. This is just going to be the hardest part for you. You're just, you're afraid of not taking action, Libra. Um, but it's just very much like, you know, if you want to like change your relationship dynamic, sometimes it does help to observe some of your friends and what's their relationship dynamic before you actually decide what do you want. You know, like, a lot, like I know one thing, um, like I used to weigh like, like over 230 pounds and, I, and I'm down to like 180. Part of that though is like one thing that a lot of people kept telling me is like, find people who have healthy eating habits, you know, find the vegan, find the vegetarian, find the low carb person, find the person who eats at all in moderation, just observe them. See what they do, how they approach it, how they think about eating, how slow they eat, how fast they eat, how do they prep their food, and kind of like pick and choose what works for out of theirs and make your own custom plan. Um, like, so that's psychology, guys. Just like do it. In terms of the outcome for the month, <sighs> okay, Spirit, what do they need to know? It's be aware that your ultimate ask is you want it all. You want the money, you want the car, you want the hot guy in the bed next to you. You want it all. You want your tribe. This is the card of your tribe, the people who just get you, the people who will just give you help when you need it without having to ask for it. But you got to be willing to receive it, Libra. You ultimately, you want your tribe of people. Um, but... Ugh, Sorry, guys, you got the, this is the caution. Things aren't like, this is what you want. Things aren't going as planned. And it's kind of be open to the helpful person who can help you with what your hang up is so that you can have this. I hope you guys have got like, <laughs> they told you that the same message in so many different ways. Be open to help. Be open to admitting that you need help. Be open to hiring someone to help you. Um, like you can have it all if you're willing to let other people in to help you, Libra. <sighs> Good luck, guys. I do know that that's hard. It was hard for me the first time I admitted that I need help. But life's amazing when you have friends who help you. It is. It, you feel supported. You feel loved. You feel cared about. It's definitely very worth it. And when you find a coach who helps you get that like, Oh, I can own my own business. Oh, this is awesome. Like, thanks. I would have never known that I could have done this without you. Like, it feels great, guys, when you hire the right people or when you accept free help from friends. Like, just go for it and do it. Um, all right, Libra, if you need support while going through this change, like, this is my jam. That's my specialty. It's what my guides love doing. I have I have a guide. Yeah, I have three guides that are all about, like, healing different aspects, like the heart chakra, the throat chakra, and allowing help in. So they can help you with that. Um, click in the upper hand, right-hand corner for a one-on-one. -on -one. Um, comment below. Let me know what's going on. If it's a quick fix, I'll help you in the comments. Give me a thumbs up. Give me a like. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel so you're updated. I'm adding law of attraction videos every week. Uh, can join my Facebook lives every Monday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, but much love, Libra. I know how hard this can be. So much love. Mwah.